Sporting Chance is a company that runs programs throughout South Africa. And okay, so what we do and what I do is we facilitate the opportunity. And that's exactly what happened here in Masipumaleli at Okanya Primary School. I was approached by Vince van der Beil, former uh, uh, Natal and Middlesex uh, opening bowler and, and one of our cricket legends, just to see if he could make a, 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 a create an opportunity for him to go into one of our township communities and, and create the opportunity. Uh, and um, that's exactly what happened. I approached Masi Pumaleli and Masi Ko and they grabbed at the opportunity and subsequently from here, Vince van der Baal is now uh, involved in the community and put uh, this program together. So it's a very special occasion and a very special man. This is a collective project between three groups. The Okanya Primary School, a school of 1,850 kids. They have one netball court until we put in these three nets and one sprint track and really for many years one coach in Kleber Jonas. And so between Okanya Primary School, the MCC and Masi Corps, which is a dedicated NGO, we set up a MCC Masi 750 sports club. We all know about the great divide between the very good model schools and the private schools and the other schools around this country and of which half of them, over 20,000 schools, half of those do not have sport after school. And so this is a way what we believe is real transformation, starting from the ground up and ensuring that people get an opportunity to play a sport, express themselves physically, get energy out, take them away from gangs and drugs, put them into something really energetic and give them a sense of identity and self-worth. Well, MCC is very um, proud and privileged to be involved uh, in this wonderful project. Uh, the idea came from Vincent van der Beide, who sits on our World Cricket Committee. It was meeting in Mumbai last December, and he provided a very inspirational presentation. And we then started talking about Masi Pumalele. And we came to a decision subsequently at the MCC that would provide funding of around £50,000 over a three-year period to get this project going. And how exciting here to see that uh, has come to reality. The sports here at this primary school are rugby, athletics, cricket, soccer and netball. And netball is the only single sport that girls can play. And women's cricket now in India, in Nepal, in China, never mind South Africa, New Zealand, Australia, is starting to grow. And I think it gives the girls here a different sporting opportunity, which we really, I think they will treasure. There are many people doing things like this. And they're all trying to do the same thing, I think, and that is to really enrich people's lives. So this is what we're trying to do. We are not trying to find the next Protea cricketer or Springbok rugby player. The idea is to make people more confident and more self-fulfilled. And so what we've got here is the MCC has given up what can be only termed startup capital. They've given us 50,000 pounds for three years. During that time, we have to raise more money, at least double it. So this is why we've started the MCC Mussey 750 Sports Club. So we want people to put their hand in their pockets, individual South Africans, and give us 100 Rand a month or 1,200 Rand a year ad infinitum. This is a sustainable project. And phase one will be to bring in a series of coaches, volunteers, part-time, and after that, once we've given them kit, equipment, the nets are here, transport money, behind me you'll see a, what it can commonly in South Africa call a felt. It's not possible to play sport here, but we want to put down artificial surfaces. And once that is totally sustainable, then we'll move up to the high schools. We chose sport. We could have chosen chess or violins, but sport instantly puts a smile on people's faces when they run they laugh. When they hit a great cricket shot, they laugh. And they love it. And it gives a sense of achievement almost instantly. And that is why, I mean, to be frank, sport did that to me. Sport irrevocably changed my life. And so I owe it a great debt. And I would like to ensure that these kids with ridiculous potential can be given the opportunity to express themselves through sport. This is a haven of great excitement and joy in this very disadvantaged township. And this is what inspired me to get involved. You come here and you fall in love with the kids. That's the way it is. FCC!